Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ekbe Amy. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And today we are reviewing a new product. I've never seen anything like this before. This is the IGK LA Blonde. And this is a purple toning treatment spray. Um, seven times brass reduction, brightening, moisture, 450 heat protection. So basically what the instructions say about this is to shampoo, condition your hair, and then while it's wet to spray this in and then um, comb through and follow with styler so <laughs> i already did this last night to my hair i sprayed just the roots um, because i wanted it to be dry before i did like this video today but i'm also going to put it in the rest of my hair so uh that's what this video is about but Basically, as soon as I put it in, like, I noticed it immediately made my hair feel kind of dry, um, which is pretty typical for, like, purple colors, purple toners. They usually always feel that way in my hair, so it's not, it's not different. It's not, like, um, unique in that way, but it did feel like my hair was kind of dry, and then, um, yeah, it dried slightly crunchy. And even right now, it definitely feels like there's something in it. Like it feels like there's some sort of product in it. I would compare my hair, um, it feels like almost as dry as if I was to put a dry shampoo in my hair. That's kind of what it feels like. It just feels like there's something in it. It's not bad, it's not good. It just is what it is. But um, what it really took to the spots that were very pale yellow and the spark ugh, it didn't really take to the other spots so again I only sprayed it in my roots and around my face and I'm going to show you what it looks like on uh, this white piece of uh, tissue so you can see the color so just doing one spray you can see how purple it is it's like a purple violet um, blue tint, but you can see how dark it is. Very dark, and I think that's why it took purpley to these spots in particular. And obviously, I haven't washed it out, but it probably will wash out because it's not like permanent, it's just like a spray in color. But um, so yeah, I'm going to show you what it looks like on my hair. So, this is what it looks like dry. And this is what it looks like when you just spray it in your hair. So the first thing I noticed is that it does take quite a bit of product to cover just a little bit of hair. And then let me All right, let's go grab a comb. This is my Tangle Teaser. I swear by this comb. This is my favorite, favorite comb. But my hair is dry. I just kind of wanted to see what it look, would look like and react to dry hair. And it looks like it's really taking and it's not moving around a lot, which means it's probably more of like a watery base and not so much like oil in it. So you definitely do not want to spray this on dry hair. That just looks like it took and it really, really absorbed. <laughs> oh, well, who cares? But this up here is what it looks like when you put it to wet hair. So... If I was going to say that pros about this is that it is so convenient to just get out of the shower, spray this all over your hair, brush through it, and not have to rinse it out. That is incredibly convenient and 10 stars for that. Um, the cons about this is that it's very dark. So if you have lighter hair like me, if you have platinum hair, the issue is going to be that it will show up purple. Um, so that's the con. So um, yeah, it's really up to you guys if you like it or not. Um, I just don't, I don't know. I'm kind of like up, I'm, I'm kind of in the air about it because on one hand it's like I already have purple conditioners I already have purple I already have so many products that are kind of similar to this I don't personally need a spray in solution um but you know 
if I didn't own any of those, I would definitely, definitely, definitely um, get this. If you don't have anything, try this first because, okay, here's my qualm about sh purple shampoos generally don't work. They take a really long time to build up the color. So purple shampoos are like my least favorite. They're really only for like if you already have toned hair and you just want to maintain it. Purple conditioners are a little shoddy because when you put them on your hair in the shower, they can take really heavily to some spots and not others. So it's a little hard to be like consistent with purple shampoo or purple conditioners. The other thing too is they do rinse out. And so they generally like the shampoo, take a while to build up color. And it's again, more for like maintaining. Now this and like something like, um, a like a dye like a hair dye these are better for people who have not toned their hair yet like me I haven't toned this hair after I bleached it it's better for you because it will do quite a big you know it'll show a difference it will um counteract that yellow so if you have not toned your hair, I think this is a really good toner, especially because it's not going to damage your hair. And it even says it's got like a heat protectant in it. So, I mean, I think that's exciting. It's really interesting, really neat. And uh, yeah, I, I like it. So I hope that helped you in some way. If you guys have any new products that you would like me to test out and try for you, um, leave those in the comments down below. I hope you have a wonderful day. <laughs> beautiful summer. That's all. That's all I want to share. I, oh, yeah. I bought this from, I think I bought it from Sephora. And I believe it was mm, the price not on it. But did pay for it myself. So, if you're wondering. See you in the next video. Bye.